Hello everyone, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. Last time we looked up, we entered the Unicorn Dungeon and have currently gained the dungeon item, which are the magnetic gloves, which both repel and attract magnetical things. And I talked about how I want to like read parts of my story off to you guys and get a response out of it. Like, you don't have to respond. It's not like I'm not demanding your anything. I can't demand you because it, I... I don't have any power over you. <laughs> I'm not a god. Nor do I want to. But, um... I'd love to, I'd love to um, read some of my story off to you guys, and just some parts to make it quick. I'd love to read some parts off, not the whole story. Just like some parts that I that I thought were pretty neat, and I'd want to, I'd want to hear your opinion. And if you're wondering, my story is fantasy-based. So if you're into fantasy, then hey, um, maybe you'll like what I'm writing. What I'm writing. And if you're not, well, you'll probably you probably won't like it that much. Though. These enemies are a pain. These enemies are so annoying because you gotta both attract and then... What the fuck? How the hell did you get in here, cat? <laughs> you gotta both attract and push some away and they always constantly change magnetical polarities. It's so fucking annoying. I'm actually gonna need this to do a little of this. Alright, alright, we got that out of the way. Let's get out of this fucking loud ass hellhole. So, now I gotta remember where I need to go, because there's still so much left in this level. Believe it or not. Leave that stuff alone. If you hear meowing, that's just my cat, so don't worry. So, why would you worry? It's a cat. <laughs> uh, I'm here though. Alrighty, so let's head back to the beginning of this map, or level, and let's look at here. Ah, alright. Let's, let's put these gloves to use. Nice. But now, it makes me wonder, does he hit- does he like- what if he uses the gloves? Does it change automatically, or does he like put on a different set of gloves? Like a different glove, or does he have two sets of gloves? Like one that's N and the other that's... What are you doing? Knock it off. Sorry, my cat got under the computer. I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? We got a key now, but I don't know where we can use it. Uh, that's like a one-way exit, I think. Oh no, apparently that opens it. Alright, let's see what's over here then. Ah. Shit. Alright, this was this is more of like a just hazard zone. Yeah. Nice. Shit. Will it spawn me back? Yeah. Alrighty. So we got a compass out of that, which is nice. No, I don't... I don't really need that much. Let's push that away and see what we can do. There's a chest over here. That's all nice. Whoa! I got a hundred loops! That was nice. I guess I can head over here now. Um... So I'm trying to remember what's gonna come up next, but 
At this point, I'm just like, you know, just whatever. Deal with it. These knights are a pain because they're super strong and they move really fast. Oh fuck. Yeah. Nice. So this was a tr this is a tricky room because when you're I accidentally activated all the enemies because I walked past them. Like what I walked by them. So what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to take out each enemy individually and then you gotta remember which enemy it was that you killed. So if I were to kill this one, I gotta remember that I killed the one right over here. And then I gotta remember I killed the one over here. You see? Fuck. Oh shit, I'm supposed to. And then once the chests pop up, you gotta open them to the according to the order you kill the enemies in. And I I am got lucky on so. Skeleton I can burn. Burn! Okay. Yes, sir. I need hearts. I need them badly. Oh, thank you. Okay, what do we have here? Uh huh. Oh, that's just to open the way. <laughs> ah. Sorry, I like to, I like organizing my stuff. Okay, so this was kind of useless. Oh, fuck. That would just lead me to that other area earlier where I had to bomb my way out. Oh, I think I'm supposed to go that way. Fuck now. So now I think I can head to the boss now because I got all the keys I need. Ow. That timing was horrible. <laughs> hmm. Let's head back to the beginning of this area and go through the teleporter. Which, if I remember correctly, the Gale Seeds can actually take you back to the uh, beginning of this level. Because they act also as um, Aurora's Wind from Oracle Seasons. Or not. Oh, I'm pretty close actually. What did I miss over here? Ah! Ow. Hey, wait a minute. I haven't gotten the boss key yet. Don't be a fucking dick. Another key, alright.
Hey, the the map layout looks like a uniform. <laughs> Ain't that clever. Yeah, so I gotta head back to the teleport at the beginning of this area. So let's get let's head on there really quickly. So I think it's just down here. That's off! much of a pickle. There we go. Yeah! Ow! Fuck! <laughs> fuck. Ah, fuck! Come on. I ain't got time to play on this treadmill. I may want- I may want to be fit, but I got- I have a fucking land to save. Alright, so now we can go fight the boss. Fuck. Oh. Hey, go through the area because he takes so much damage. Alrighty, so. Yeah, we can head back here now. I get for trying to play it off cool. Fucking die. Alright. Yo! just because it, it's kind of a trolling area with all the fucking bats. There we go. Yeah. I have no idea what this thing is, but we actually got to use this um, metal ball thing, whatever it is. And we got to... We got to pull it to hurt this guy. What I normally do is, um... The best way to hurt this guy is to corner him. Or get him... get him stuck... Get him stuck in like a... I don't know how to say it exactly. You just gotta troll him. Oh. 
Then for the last one. Oh, that was the last one. I thought there was two more. Whatever. Yeah, we did. I don't normally like fighting that boss just because you gotta use the wrecking ball, and there's also the possibility they could kill yourself. <laughs> anyway, we got the nurturing warmth, an essence of nature. Balmy days build strong saplings with their nurturing warmth. But there'd be more to that, but whatevs. The Zelda game. What are you gonna do? But you can only pack so much into a Game Boy game. <laughs> And now a word from a tree. Link, nurturing wharf has brought me strength. I saw I saw in a dream. I saw a dream of Link inside vast room. Perhaps an essence is hidden in some sleep. Oh, alrighty then. The next the next area we need to go to, we actually need to collect more of these things. But anyway, that's gonna be all for now everyone. Leave a comment if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to my channel grow. And in the next video, we're going to go on a jewel hunt. So until then, I will see you all later.